Hello everyone and welcome to Codenbox Automation Lab. This is Sherful. Here we are going to start a brand new tutorial which is other than mobile automation using APM tool. So we'll have a number of tutorials where we're going to start from the scratch. Like what is APM, how APM works, the difference, uh, you know, the benefits of using APMs, the architecture of APMs, how to set up your machine to work with the APM. And then we'll see number of tutorials, you know, different example, you know, for Android automation using APM code with one of the, it's like could be the Java, JavaScript, but in this, in this tutorial, we're going to see using a Java. And then it will also see number of example, you know, for doing the iOS automation for using the APM. And also we'll see the structure, like yeah, the framework, different frameworks, you know, for APM we can develop. So let's see this. This lecture, we're going to see the introduction part, which is like, what is APM? So o APM is an open source mobile automation tool. It's, it means like it's a free of cost. Anybody can use for personal or for industry use. It is a cross platform testing tool. So it means it works on different operating system. Like it works on iOS app. It works for Android or even Firefox OS too. It works on native, hybrid, and mobile web apps. What does it mean? It means, you know, when app develop on a mobile platform, the pure mobile platform, which is a native app. And a hybrid is, you will probably you have seen that there's an app, it's a build on, on the mobile platform, but it support mobile view as well as web view. So it's web is embedded inside the mobile view. So, which is the combination of mobile and web, it's called the hybrid app. And also the app, it's only works on the web view, like in the mobile, it has a browser, like Chrome browser, right? So a lot of apps, the web apps we have, like it's called, you know, it support mobile web browser too, right? So if you, so at that time, you know, you don't need to, uh, any app, just you open your browser on your mobile. And then you, you run that application, you go to say amazon.com, right? You will see, it will show the mobile view, you know, through the app, through the web, right? It's through the uh, Chrome web. So whatever, you know, your, your apps, like a native hybrid or even using the mobile browser, it works for all types of view, you know, to the automation. It support Selenium web tool. API library. This is one of the best and cool part. If you're familiar with the Selenium, Selenium code or Selenium library, so all the Selenium code, Selenium library, you know, it, it can applicable in all APM. This APM is the extension of the Selenium family, right? APM is the only tool I can tell you that works cross platform. There's a, some number of other, other uh, tools you will find in the market. It's called like Calabas. Calabas is only the tools it works for specifically for iOS app. There's a Robotium. It works for Android. There's a Selenium Android that also works for Android, but there's no other tools unlike uh, APM that works for both, you know, platform like Discover, iOS, or Android. So you can write a common code that the automation is script and it will can execute on iOS app as well as Android app. So this is one of the base part of the APM. That's why APM is famous for the automation world. So what other, you know, different languages support it? It's a, since API is the extension of the Selenium. So similar like Selenium support multiple languages. APM also support multiple languages like Java, Java is Python, C Sharp and Ruby. So you can use any one of the, you know, the language to write your script or do your automation, you know, in APM. So this is, you know, also, that's why it is very famous. It's not only the cross platform. It also gives you the dynamic choice, you know, different multiple choice for choosing your language. Okay. So that's pretty much the introduction about the APM. And in our next, le next lecture, we'll see the architecture of APM, how APM it works, you know, architecture design or behind the scene, how it APM exactly works. Thanks a lot. Have a good one. Bye-bye.